Hello and welcome back to Expeditions and Mud Runner game. We are back in Arizona. We are going back out to do the contract or the expedition that we failed to complete last time out. Now, I do not know if any of this saved or or or, or anything. Um, so we're going to take out two lights for us this time. Put the jack, take two of those. We will have extra fuel. And we will take some spare parts. Yeah, that's us. Um, do we need anything else? I don't think so. We are fully stocked. Uh, we will have, just in case we've got time to do some other things, we'll take the plug. Get some anchors. I think that's it. Yeah, I'll be alright for that one. Alright, so we need to take our logistician again. Uh, we need our mechanic. So let's have a mechanic. Ooh. And we will. Um, no, we won't. We won't take another operator. That's fine. And we are going to head out. Let's, uh, let's go. Yeah, last time oh, I didn't read it properly. And I thought we only needed one beacon. Oh, we've got to put them both out. Yep, okay, that's fair enough. That is fair enough. We're not trade between trucks again. Have to move one out before we move. Again, the uh, I'm recording this straight after the last episode. By the way, um, I haven't got a clue how the um, how that drone works. Like, how do I get that to come and refuel? Is there something else that I need to be fitting to myself? Because we are not getting the, uh, the extra fuel, from what I can gather. There's no extra 300 litres of fuel when we get a refuel. We've just got the two tents on the back. Now, we should be able to get there reasonably well. Uh, we've, we've sort of done the trip now. I'll still get stuck where I got stuck before, and you know, but we won't have to do all the long details. Do my best to get as quick as I can. I don't know if it's morning or evening, but likewise. Yeah, let's get down there. Not a good start. Got ourselves at risk already. We don't want to take a risk, we want to be safe as we can be. But last time out, we did manage to do the photo opportunity. We did find two upgrades. We uh, did the fish find thing that was quite confusing for me anyway. I didn't know really what that was all about. Oh, there's one of our cameras there. We popped that there. And I believe there was a shortcut here. Took last time. Is it here? I don't know. Oh no, that's that's not it. What is it? That might be. That might be. We definitely had a bit where we just shot across, didn't we? So you hopefully we can cross. So you're by the by the reeds, by the grass, and then. Hopefully up there we get. <coughs> Excuse me, I cannot clear my throat today, which is nothing new. So Oh 
pop one over, off we go. I just, I'm so guarded about the whole light beacons. It's definitely not getting brighter, is it? Oh, we do have all our bridges down, stuff like that. And we sort of know the route we want to take. So that should make this easy. Whether it then affords us enough time to be able to go and get the truck that I wanted to get last time, do that rescue, I don't know. Or whether we go for one of the other jobs that we stumbled across along this way. Could be a possibility. There was a lot of things that we found while out. Like that up there, that's part of the lost car anyway. So many, so many little markers now on our map. It's good, that means there's you know, plenty for us to find and do. But trying to work them all in and around the expeditions is becoming my challenge. So what? So it's not actually showing me on here. Oh no, it's an avalanche, that's what that is. So, if we'd have took that route, takes you to a big tree for some reason. We've got an avalanche. I wonder if taking that avalanche and then going along here <laughs> would have got us to the upgrade. Where was that upgrade? That was over here somewhere, weren't it? That was a nightmare. But that's where the truck is that I want. That right airdrop. Do I understand what the eye is for? Whether we need to go up there and have a little look or something? Or like, when I say for something, I actually look for something, like, for a, for a task. So that might be when uh, taking out the avalanche comes into, into play. I thought I had my uh, my guy that do these things out. Oh, I didn't bring him, did I? No. Not to worry. Not to worry. Cargo. I think I said that before. It doesn't sort of show up as anything. I think some of the climbs that we struggled with before it shouldn't have to do now. Obviously we've got some climbing, but getting up on that plateau before was a bit mature. If my memory can hold out for me, I have a, an absolutely appalling recall, but I, only, I literally just press stop record, start record, so we can go out and get this done. So I should be able to remember some of what we need to do. Now we get too, too stuck, like route wise and stuff like that, we need to go up there. Shame all your anchors disappear because we had quite a few down. So that's like point in the way. What is that?
tell you what, let's go. Oh, save. Save that man. <laughs> Let's go and have a little look. Oh, no. I always end up. Oh, there's one there anyway, never mind. I always end up on a bit of a detour and doing other things. It's all about exploring, though. This game is about exploring. And that's where it's showing up that gorge. Tell us to have a look, so let's go have a look. Sometimes trying to get this truck to turn <laughs> is a nightmare. I have to say, this is probably for something completely different or anything to do with what I'm doing. But not gonna have a look. Got the ghostly hologram. I haven't got a clue what any of that is about. So there might be something else over that way. Those bridges we've seen before, that's the climb. Airdrop. So on the map, that's where that little lookout bit is. We found that's the avalanche. So I, I know, perhaps you're supposed to come up there and run across. But we did it that way. But anyway, we've been up, we've seen it. So I haven't got a clue what the, the ghostly holograms are all about. Whether they just thought it'd be funny or interesting to add in non-ghost ghosts, I don't know. It's in the drop.
if after the last episode you uh, <laughs> come back, I do appreciate you. I know it was a little bit of a shambles. I guess not every expedition could be perfect, but it wouldn't hurt if I actually read the things we needed to put it. Or if I didn't waste the things we needed, like I could have come back with a beacon for the fishing of the time, miss that off. Sort of did it to myself, really. It is annoying, but I am not perfect. I do make these mistakes. If you're perfect, then good on you. If you can do this first time, perfect runs every time, then you know what, you're a legend. I am not. I am <laughs> Lenny Fallible. Alright, this was fun if I remember lightly. I think even with that little detour up to the for the nothingness of the hut. We're still, uh, still getting around pretty well. We're doing a pretty good time. Clearance on that one's nasty, isn't it? Could be a little bit wider. Turn you, turn you. That saves. Drive me mad. So. We still need to go through. We can't climb that, can we? gotten up there and just driven across there. I'm sure we could have. I'm sure, sure, sure we could have. I won't look at the map because it would just annoy me that I didn't think of it. I can see it. Now, this was a little bit of a the doozy last time. So, then we're just going to go around it. Going through it was not, not the most fun. I mean, it weren't the worst part of that hour, <laughs> to say the least. But it wasn't the funnest bit. Seriously, that stuck. Oh, don't you. As if. Oh. Nah. What a... Glitched me into the bloody tree. Oh, oh, oh. We nearly had words.
Now, if all goes well with my scheduling, this should go out on Sunday. Am I in the right spot? I think so. Yeah, this should go out on Sunday. This may be the last pre-recorded episode we have for a while. Because time restraints and things are now starting to kick in. I did say, if you if you were on my channel before uh, Expeditions, you'll know. I did say we we're going to probably going to have to go to a live streaming channel for a little while. Uh, for my partner's work and things like that. Like my time to record has sort of disappeared. Which is obviously absolutely fine. Um, so this may be our last pre-recorded. And we'll try and do... Instead of like every evening having an episode, I'll try to do two streams on YouTube of expeditions. That'll probably around about seven o'clock. Probably do it twice a week. And then we could we could do that for like two or three hours. I don't know. We'll, we'll probably end up covering more of the game quicker. I just think that's how it's gonna have to be for a little while. We'll keep chugging through. Obviously there'll be available to watch afterwards as I do with all my content but this may be the last pre-recorded you see, see what sort of time I have to get any more done so I think we're still going to have to climb up aren't we up and down again As we go all the way down and all the way up. Is that a thing? We go have a look. I'm going to try and I'll keep. Um, Snow Runner hard mode, that will stay as pre-recorded. There's a few of them on the schedule. But because that's a day a day, for an hour an episode, I think that'll be easier to keep doing that that way. Oh, that's how I want to have that done. I think Expeditions, we can move to a live stream. That should be fine. And I'll try and make sure the ETS is up weekly. And like I said in the last ETS stream, we will uh, mix in a live stream every now and then with that because it's quite fun to do. So, one beacon. So yeah, I did, I did say there would be changes. I'll try and put a post out over the weekend and uh, let people know. Because then I'll, I'll definitely be able to keep my Twitch streams going as well then. when I'm uploading recordings I can't uh, stream obviously because I'm, my, my limited time for recording and editing is I have a limited window of when I can actually set my uploads but so it all sort of knocks on to it. it's, it's each other sort of thing Deliver our supplies. We should now have base camp here as well. Or an outpost. And we've got a miscellaneous thing. But we are going to try and continue. We, we've got some money out of that. 31 grand. Doesn't make up for the. Well, it does sort of make up for the big loss from last time. But we have. Wrong address. Lost cargo. If I start tracking that. Oh, there's quite a few of them, so we probably won't do that. That is the same lost cargo. Out of the dirt. Pull the truck out of the dirt. And that's that truck. That's me. Is that that truck? Oh, yeah, we've got two things marked up. 
just this truck here. So what are these then? That's lost cargo. That was back in line. What was that then? Uh, the equipment of the last research expedition was completely out of order, sadly. You need to get them up and running. Ah, oh, so it's just dropping off some repair equipment. Out of there. I say just. I mean, that looks like a beast of a mission. Or, shall I say, last time out... What's an extremely long one, and um, today we'll just have ourselves a short one with a successful um, outpost done. I think that's what we'll do. So we'll head back to HQ with that being a completed mission, and that will be it for this one. So this, like I say, this may be the last pre-recorded one for a while, but that does mean we'll try and go live twice a week. Um, I'm trying to think this week, possibly Monday. Monday and Wednesday probably would work well so we'll try and do that um, hopefully you've enjoyed this one if you have give a big fat thumbs up down below if you're new to the channel hit the subscribe button turn the bell notification on find out when new videos are going live as always comments and feedback down there you guys have a wonderful day and hopefully I'll see you on Monday for a live stream bye for now